So now the Aguilar just made this meme about me. By the way, this meme format sucks. And it's pretty funny because I'm a cash-based PT in Canada. I'm not subsidized by anyone. People come to pay with cash <laughs> and then they leave because they value my services. I have no fucking clue what you're talking about. And that line of reasoning is even more illogical because of the fact that in Canada, physical therapy isn't even subsidized in general. So there's rare cases of surgery, like day one or two when you're still in the hospital, and then like stroke patients, and that's it. Like 99% of physio is paid out of pocket by the patient, submitted to the will of the free market. Like that's, you don't even know what you're talking about. Like, what a surprise. Now he doesn't know what he's talking about. Uh, even if physio were subsidized, right? If the government paid for it, 100%. You know who else gets paid 100% by the government in Canada? Doctors. So, like, does that mean that the doctor who's performing life-saving surgery on a bullet wound or a stab wound or repairing a fracture, he's a scammer and you should learn how to go spin with Naudi Aguilar? <laughs> I don't think so. That's a really dumb line of argument, man. It's pretty obvious that you're just coping and you're mad because in the US, the government thinks that physical therapy is valuable. And I don't think that, phys uh, you know, functional patterns is. You know why? Because it's not. <laughs> what the fuck? He then goes on to say that uh, I've earned the right to make a living. Uh, I have a bachelor's and a master's in physical therapy and I have three additional years of university education. Now you have nothing except conspiracy theories you made about movement. And then you go on to say that we can't correct imbalances. It's because imbalances don't seem to predict pain reliably and they don't need to be corrected. I have a big post about it with scientific reference, which you should try using. If you want to look at it, it's in my educational guide right below. Very easy to access. There's all the references posted. It's actually the first post in my second educational guide. So I provide reference, which you never do because your approach is made up and stupid again, and mine is scientifically validated. And then the little man also says, there's a reason that you can't get results right over there. Um, your approach is proved on nothing except before and after pictures. I can stand different. Hey, I just fixed my posture. That's fucking easy. You don't need special, stupid, esoteric training like you give to know how to do that. And by the way, my approach is warranted. I'll show you why. So now he says that my approach is, you know, doesn't show his results. I use the nice UK guidelines, which are based on 564 individual studies. You know how many are done on functional planners? Zero, zero. And the nice UK guidelines, most of the studies use a control group, which is something that functional pattern has never done. They say, oh, we fixed posture, oh, we fixed posture, cool. Now he's probably gonna answer something like, oh, but it's too new, it's too emergent. He's been saying for like 10 years that he's gonna conduct research on it and the results are gonna blow us away. Yeah, he hasn't done any research and he hasn't even looked at it. He's lying because you know why? When I, people ask him, you should do an RCT, he calls it an RTC. Why don't you do a, a, a RTC? FP works, let's prove it, hey, fuck fake. That's literally research 101. It, you take, you like Google research and that's gonna come up. He didn't even look, he has no intention because he would lose money because people would realize that his approach is stupid. So yeah, show results, show results, whatever. Um, again, I showed the nice UK guidelines, 564 articles, and that's just for low back pain. There's much more. It's like tens of thousands of scientific articles which use results to drive the data and they show that physiotherapy works and then it's good, right? None support functional patterns. So either test it or shut the fuck up, all right? And whatever, if you don't believe in research, that's okay. You're talking about showing the results. You know what, Naudi? I'll beat you at any fuck, it's a challenge, all right? I'll beat you at any fucking sport you're choosing that is like a comprehensive, you know, it has to be comprehensive. So something that involves strength, something that involves speed, you know, any sport, soccer, basketball, badminton, wrestling, running i don't give a shit i'm better than you at every sport that you can imagine except the made-up sport you made because you suck at lifting and any other athletic thing show your results show your results look i'm fucking much more muscular than you and again i'm a better athlete than you at every conceivable measurable level except maybe at functional patterns because again that's something you made up because you feel bad about being a shit athlete so yeah now to, to summarize you think that you're super manly you call yourself an alpha or whatever that means I had an alpha male dad and I had an alpha female mom. I had two alpha parents and it shaped my character quite a bit. So if you're one of these beta males. Who uh, but you're just a scared little man who memes people behind their backs and you've blocked me. So I can't even answer because what you said is wrong. So that's probably a good thing. Um, the government doesn't pay me. You're just mad because in the States people value physical therapy and they reimburse it and they don't re reimburse your little scam that you do with fucking made up spinning movements or whatever. By the way, you're not an alpha, you just hate women. 
and you're a terrible person. That's two different things, all right? Yeah, be a man and show your stupid results, all right? Let's compare the results. If functional pattern is so good, you sh it should be easy to beat me. You literally invented it. You're the best at it, all right? And I'm just some random guy. Accept the challenge, you coward. All right, Nadi. so this is the official challenge, all right? Because you're such an alpha, I know what you're gonna do is refuse it because you can't, you know, you talk smack, but you can't back it up. You're gonna refuse it or ignore it and then go back cowering to your little echo chamber. But if you're a real man, what you would do is you would accept it, all right? Any sport, you pick it, I'll come, I'll fucking fly to Hawaii and I'll beat you at it. We'll film it, everyone will see it and then we'll, they'll see what a fucking liar you are. Those are my results, bye.